In this video, I will show you how I rig the tube bait in three different ways. The first one is very traditional. You take a tube style jig that looks like this. This one is made of tungsten and is from Swagger Tungsten. Depending on the size of the jig head and the tube, you may want to wet it with water, saliva, or even an oil-based scent so it can slip into it very easily. You simply just slide the jig all up head first and then you break open the plastic where the eye sits. Your rig is now complete. The second one is called the stupid rig, which is a very interesting name. You use the same jig head style as the first one and you rig it weedless. What you want to do is take the jig and position it over the tube as it would look like as it was Texas rigged. So you can see where the hook will come out of the tube and also the eye. Then you want to take the hook and from under the tube, slip the hook up the tube and out where the hook's supposed to come out. From here, I highly recommend you lubricate the jig before you slide the tube up and pull the hook out of the tube. As you pull the hook out, this is where the lubrication helps as the head goes all the way to the top and it will need to turn in a cramped space. Once the head of the jig is in position, pop the eye of the jig out and now you take the point of the hook, align where it's supposed to go in and it come out. Puncture through as you would do in a Texas rig and your rig is now complete. Note that these two styles of rigging will require you to do the rigging without being tied onto a line. The last one is something that I have demonstrated before, and it uses a wheelie style worm hook. This is a 3 alt Gamagasu G-Lock worm hook, and we will use a bell style weight. Here I have a tungsten one, again from Swagger Tungsten. The hook and weight should look like this inside of the tube. To rig this, you put the weight inside the tube and slide it all the way to the top. Then you simply do your normal Texas rigging, but right after you insert your hook in, you need to also put the hook point through the eye of the weight before coming back out. You then slide the tube to the top of the eye of the hook, rotate 180 degrees so that the hook is now ready to go back in to the bottom of the tube and out the other side just like a Texas rig. And there you have it. Now that completes the three ways I like to rig a tube bait. Which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching.